Hey guys, Sean back again with another uh, Modern Warfare 2 commentary on Domination on an Invasion. Um, this one here, I was actually starting with the um, intervention with ACOG Scope because I'm attempting to get challenges done with it as I'm trying to get to Prestige again as soon as possible. Um, in a party with Slap Happy Nuns and going to see if I can't flank over here to the... Um, right side after because we spawn on the seaside which is I, I don't think I've ever spawned on the opposite side so I wouldn't even know where to go um, but usually there's some people coming down this alleyway um, using because those, those cars down there provide pretty decent cover um, gonna see if I can slide in through here and um, help out and what set up this match is um, intervention with ACOG uh, G18s with a Kimbo Claymores stuns, um, slide of hand pro, stopping power pro, and steady aim pro. Um, hopped on B to cap it, changed out the G18 and Kimbo's for an M16 bling. Um, I believe it's got an ACOG and a silencer on it. This was a, a, a pretty good round. Um, final score is 27-1. and one. Um, The la death is at the end of the match. It was a stupid ass move on my part. Um, guy catches me with a throwing knife so made me his bitch um, what we're doing here is we've got the C and the B flag so we are trying to hold them in their A spawn um, we've got our UAV up so we know that there's a couple of them out out and about that are actually outside of the spawn area um, catch this sniper here don't know what he's doing hip spray with the M16 um, M16 is not a good gun for me I don't really know how to use it um, it, I, I don't know if it's just me expecting to kill everybody in one burst or what, um, but it's not something, not something I do very well. And right there, what you saw me do is you saw me swap out the, um, G18s for an MP5K silence, and that's pretty much what I use for the rest of the match. Um, I do get, oh, I'm sorry, not Steady Aim Pro, Sit Rep Pro. Or Sit Rep, not Sit Rep Pro. Um, I do quite a bit of work with this, um, going to try and set up and once we get the B area back what I what I tend to do is I tend to just patrol in between those two buildings um, pick off as many people as possible just try and go in and do some work and, and, and get some air support and help some people out call my predator missile there I was going to drop it on C but I realized they were pushing up on the B um, we're still winning right now we've got A flag um, They've got B and C, which B on this map is probably the it's probably one of the harder ones um, to defend unless you got a bunch of guys with riot shields sitting down there by the B flag. Um, kind of just going back here to check to see if there's anybody trying to flank us. Um, I'll come down out of this perch here in a second. Um, again, checking checking the area. Uh, I'm gonna come around here see if there's anybody out. If there is, I'm gonna clear them out. Um, don't see anybody, but their their guy pops in. Um, again, my reload itis constantly reloading. I'm gonna hop on B and cap it, and then this is pretty much gonna be all she wrote. Um, we're gonna hold B and A, and then I think we actually end up dominating them for about the last couple minutes of the match. That guy comes in there, probably should have killed me using the models, uh, <coughs> but gives me my pay low. I don't know if he was injured or what, but he went down down rather rather easily. I'm going to check this flank, see if anybody's coming. I've got nothing. Uh, I'm going to push up. He's going to try and drop below my stun, which I don't know how to get a hit marker from that. And I'm going to see if we can't slide up here. Um, got my pave low up. I'm going to be a little bit more aggressive. Um, right now I haven't died yet. I'm still working a flawless, so I'm... <coughs> Normally whenever I'm, I'm getting close to a flawless match, specifically on a domination, I'm going to... Um, be a little bit more conservative I do get a little aggressive and try and push up into the C spawn um, where was I at sorry Pavlo's up doing work I missed the score there um, gonna try and check see if anybody's coming up here um, I know they're back there don't know where I saw a guy there pop up in the scope uh, I'm not real sure what to do with him and they get some air support so I'm gonna lay low for a few minutes I know um, 
from the start we had a couple teams carrying stinger missiles or a couple team members carrying stinger missiles so i decided not to not to have them equipped for this match and if i would have died i would have just switched over and uh, decided to take out the air support this guy here with the riot shield um he's kind of a i don't know if he's a slow kid or what but he was completely surrounded. Um, I catch him in a minute. And I, I bait him into switching out his shield. Um, he's going to be coming up across that tank over there by B. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop a couple shots at his feet. Not here, but it'll happen in a second. There we go. Uh, model guy again. Been seeing those a lot lately, usually with the bling. Um, I think here is the riot shield best way I attack these guys is I will shoot at them a couple times then I'll aim down at the feet and then what I'll do is it, they'll get the perception that you're reloading because of delay in shots and uh, then once they pop down their shield you just fire away um, 22 and 0 uh, I think I'm going to push up into their spawn now see if I can't get a little action um, plus I know we got the air support that's going to supply me as some, some cover while I'm on my way back here uh, th this typically is not a smart move and I don't know why in the hell I would do this I don't know if I would recommend this but when you've got two points um, like we have and we've had primarily th through most of the match I would not um, I would not push up this far um, what will happen is, is you'll push up this far and then the teammate will cap C and then their spawn's going to be random especially when they're being dominated um so again, this is not recommended. Um, I'm going to try and see if I can't get a couple people trying to sneak down the alleyway. Saw that guy, tried to shoot him. Uh, teammate knifed him, which was was a good thing. I do hear that they're capping B, but I know that the we got a chopper gunner up and a harrier. Uh, one fired at that guy, fired a little late. Uh, th this match, I I don't know. Th this team we played was was freaking terrible. Um, this was the second or third match in a row, a little aim fail there, uh, where we'd played these guys the, the first time. It wasn't, wasn't as easy. Um, they did the same pretty well. I'm going to shoot that guy in the balls. Hit him again, right in the dick. That's awesome. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know what it was about this map or if it was the fact that this was the fourth or fifth time I'd played this thing today. Um, trying to get some better map selection up for you guys so so we can get some, some different strategies and, and going but it doesn't seem like I've played favela or uh, I did post a favela match but that was I did post that today but that was actually from a couple days ago but the map selection on this is um, it's not being very nice to me I mean it gives me either invasion uh, Karachi I don't know why the screen's jumpy there. Um, I thought there was a stealth bomber coming in, but I think it was probably something with my connection. But yeah, the map selection has been pretty much shit. Um, I keep playing the same... See, here's my death. I, I had the sniper rifle out, went to switch to my secondary to the MP5 um, without taking cover, and guy throwing knives me. Um, only death of the match... As of right now, I think I'm going to play a little conservative since we're dominating. There's no way that they can win this. Um, unless they were to take over all three flags, which the way these guys are playing, it's not going to happen. So I'm just going to hang back, keep the score up, and, and move on about my business. But yeah, again, the maps, keep playing the same maps over and over and over again. It's getting kind of old. Um, it's either Invasion or Karachi. Um, I did have a decent map on Subbase today, actually, with the intervention. But, of course, I forgot to hit record. I think it was 28 or 29 and 1. Um, but that's it, 200 to 102. Um, final score is 27 and 1. I um, hope you guys enjoyed, and I appreciate you watching. Thank you.